Magnus. How's it going? Floodmon 14 here. And we're back with. This is Let's Play Yu Gi Oh! Nightmare Truminor. Alright, guys, welcome back. Floodmon 14 here. And I think I need to turn the volume up slightly here. Uh, let's try about 40. I think that seems about good. Yeah, yeah. Alright, anyway, well, let's head back out. So, last time, the, uh, the Battle CD Tournament officially began, aka the Expert Cup. Uh, so, let me actually maximize the map here. So now you'll notice that you have two areas you can go. The main, the regular town, you know, where your home is. And then uh, to get to that place we were at last time, what you want to do is to go here to the train station. So you basically have two areas of the map. Now, um, certain duelists will be on uh, each map, you know, depending on what time of day it is. Uh, but I think for now, um, some of the new duels we want to find will be on this second part of the map. Um, and also, as I, I think I mentioned this last episode, uh, also as I mentioned last episode, the main person, you know, to progress the story, the person you're looking for is uh, Ishizu Ishtar. Yeah, and you want to defeat her in the duel. Uh, so, yeah, and that's uh, not really spoilers. I mean, she was in the Battle City Tournament. Uh, she basically is the reason the uh, Battle City Tournament started at all, you know, because she handed Obelisk to Kaiba and then, you know, suggested he throw a tournament to uh, get the other ones, so the other god cards. So, uh, oh, man, Rebecca, darn. Teddy, isn't it great to find duelists all over the city? Huh? You want to duel me? Fine with me. Okay, here comes another challenging duel, guys. Rebecca, round two, Big Bang USA. Uh, let's see if we can beat her this time. I don't know. I don't know. Wish me luck, guys. This is a tough duel. Always. Always a tough duel. We'll go first. We got the Luster Soldier deck. Don't know if I have many threes, level threes in the Luster Soldier deck, but let's say, ooh, well, we got Heavy Storm first turn. That is good. I guess we do have some level threes. I, it's funny, I say, oh, I don't think we have any level threes, I say, as I draw a handful of level threes in BLS. In fact, we did draw BLS in our first turn. Normally, I would send Sinister Serpent. Let me send Xset Cannon to the graveyard. Yeah. And actually, Rebecca, I'm just gonna set one monster here. Go ahead, go ahead. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got, Rebecca. Ah, not gonna send my monster to the graveyard, huh? All right, fine. I draw Lejeune, huh? Ah, well, let's summon Lejeune. Okay, and I'll summon Sand Game. All right, Rebecca. Show me the gravity bind. What do you got? Oh, no gravity bind. Not yet. Okay. Well, she might have level limit as well, so in her hand. Just didn't play it yet. Scapegoats, huh? Yeah, that is kind of annoying. But not really too much we can do about that. I mean, even if we tried to heavy storm there, she could have just chained scapegoat. Don't know if she would have, but, ah, eh, you know, scapegoat's annoying, but it's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. It's just going to stall us for a while. Anyway, how are you guys doing today? <laughs> I'm just digging the music. Uh, today is uh, June 11, 2022. It is currently 11 p.m. at night. Two more face downs, huh? That is uh, dangerous, I say. Ooh, United we stand is good, it's good. But not yet. We're not gonna activate that yet. Uh, let's just attack first, see what happens here. So, Lajin trying to attack the face down. Ah, there's the gravity bind. That's what I was waiting on. That's what I was waiting on. Alright, same again. Take out a scapegoat. And we will uh, play, probably play Heavy Storm next turn. So, uh, yeah, by the way, um, in between the last episode and... Oh, I guess I'll set Night of Sailor. In between the last episode and this episode, 
Uh, something interesting happened. So I was uploading uh, a batch of uh, Nightmare Troubadour episodes I had recorded early, uh, earlier. Um, and, um, yeah, basically, um, uh, it looked like the upload had failed. You know what I mean? Because uh, when I woke back up to, uh, today, um, basically, ooh, yes, yeah, we'll get rid of that. Seven tools, ooh, we'll get rid of that. And Mystical Space Typhoon, we got rid of a lot of good stuff there. Um, but yeah, I thought that the episode recording had failed. Let me... Okay, believe it or not, I'm actually gonna... No, 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 no yeah. Let's flip Night Assailant. Uh, let, me, let me let me pay attention here before I continue telling my story. But yeah, I thought the upload had failed. And, uh, because it was basically stuck whenever I woke up at, like, uh... It was stuck on, like, 29%. All of the uploads were stuck around, you know, 29% or so. I'm gonna equip United. We stand to Legend, yeah. And, um, but yeah, it actually, um, so I think YouTube has fixed some stuff in their, um, in their upload system. Because, like, basically all the uploads look like they were frozen, but, you know, and they weren't progressing either. I waited, like, you know, 15, 15 minutes after I woke up and was like, ah, well, let's see if the upload progresses, you know, now that I woke back up and woke my computer up. And no, no, it, the, the upload progress was still frozen. Uh, but um, I was just like, well, you know what, let me try. Let me just try to, uh, you know upload again and let me just click the same video I did and it actually like resumed the progress you know it took some time loading in and um, and then I had to I had to rewrite a bit of the description but yeah yeah the, uh, the it, it basically like it it picked up because like before it wouldn't do that it wouldn't like if you had to up upload like let's say you had to upload you know 35% of the way done and then you uh, you like lost power or something. You lost your internet for an hour. Uh, the the ba basically. Oh, really? Well, you know, that's okay. I've got DLS. It's okay, guys. It's okay. Now we got some darks in the graveyard. I mean, that does hurt a bit, but um, but yeah, basically, before if you like lost your internet or something, and it was like you know midway through. Doesn't matter what we search here. Uh, then you, that was it. You lost all the progress. You know, even if you went back a couple hours later. And then, uh, you know, edited the video. You know, you would have to start from scratch, basically, is what I'm saying. Uh, but apparently, they fixed something in the system. Um, or, you know, I don't know. Or something wonky was going on with my computer or something. Because, basically, like, when I I tried to re-upload the same batch of episodes. And, you know, I didn't have to restart over. It started from, like, you know, 27% or whatever it was at. And, yeah, right now, the same uploads are at, uh, 55%, so that's good, that's really good, I'm glad, um, I'm glad YouTube fixed that, because that definitely helps, that definitely helps, so, anyway, we win, we basically vlogged our way through that episode, ah, we get 102 experience, that is, man, yeah, as, as tough as, as it is to take on Rebecca, she gives a lot of Kaiba core points, so, might be worth it to take her on, I don't know. I don't know, I'm just scared of her deck sometimes because, you know, she gets her lock on. It, it, depending on which deck I have, there's really nothing I can do, so that's, that's a bit scary to me. So, uh, let's see who y'all is out here. Someone right here. Another unknown duelist. A lot of unknown duelists we have at this point. Uh, also, uh, something I might do... Uh, as tedious as it sounds, I might actually register everyone we can before uh, we take on the Shizu and advance the story. Because look at this, we got like three people we haven't registered yet. Uh, and sometimes you need to find a certain character. Oh, hey, it's Joey! Hey, buddy, we haven't dueled in a while. Yeah, my good buddy, you faced the greatest duels in history, but you never even gave up once. Yeah. I want to be tough, just like him. I challenge you to do it. What do you say, buddy? Yeah, let's do it, Joey. Really, really, pull your max hand. <laughs> Versus lesser soldier, awesome. Yeah, um, I don't know. I don't know. I might register like quite a few people, you know. And um, by the way, if you stay on the right side of the map, you know where your home is. I'll listen to this music, man. Da 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 da. 
to do. Man, epic. Um, but yeah, I made it take some time. If you stay on the right side of the map where your home is, the story won't actually advance at all. So yeah, I may actually, you know, <laughs> as weird as it is, I know we just ended a grinding session, you know, uh, before, you know, with the Infinite Shadow games, but I may go on another one and just kind of register everyone we can. I don't know. I don't know. Because sometimes you need to find, like, certain people in the story, you know what I mean? And it does help if you have everyone registered. Ooh, I just thought about something. Skull Dice. Man, I shouldn't have set Shrink this turn. Oh, well, attack? Oh! Wow, no Skull Dice, Joey? I'm shocked. I'm, I'm honestly shocked that attack even worked. No Skull Dice, no, like, Mirror Force or anything? Wow. Yeah, I definitely should have saved Shrink there, but... Ooh, I went for it, guys. Uh, that was a little scary, but it, it worked out. All right, what are you gonna do, Joey? Yeah, I summon Rocket Boy in attack mode. <laughs> yeah, I clip my Rocket Boy with the legendary sword. Ah, interesting. So, let's see. I'm gonna activate Robin Goblin. Uh, I may also have to activate Metal Morph, though, because we have the same attack. Now, something you should know, though, is that Rocket Warrior Dove does have a special ability. Uh, yeah, check this out. So, can only be applied during the battle phase of your own turn. Basically, it goes into its invincible mode. Any damage this monster takes is reduced to zero. What that means is it's not going to be destroyed as a result of battle. Any monster attacked by this card has its attack decreased by 500 until the end phase. Yeah. So, I think we'll activate Metal Morph here on Lajin. That way, Lajin can survive the battle. Go! Full Metal Force! Yeah, he's not gonna take any damage. Yep, yep, see. But, uh, yeah. That way, our Legion will survive. Good little combo there, though. Rocket Warrior and, uh, Legendary Sword, so. Alright, we draw. Nice. I think I'll set in main phase two. Let's just try to attack for now. Let's see what happens. Kill Legion! Attack with the power of Metal Morph! Oh! Ah, there's the Skull Dice. There's the Skull Dice. We got lucky. He didn't draw it until his last turn. Well, that two's not going to matter, Joey, because guess what? Now Metal Morph activates, and I gain half of your monster's points. <laughs> I always knew you're a third-rate duelist with a fourth-rate dead wheeler. I saw that move him. All right, and main phase two. I don't have any spells in the grave, so let's just set... Night Assailant. And we will end our turn, guys. Alright, all he's got is two face downs, nothing in his hand. Uh oh. Uh, time was it? Time you let go. Is he gonna get it? Of course he's gonna get it. He's Joey, right? Oh! Well, spoke too soon. That's one of the few times we've seen him fail with Time Wizard. It's kinda shocking, honestly. Dunamis Valkyria, Kogik Shoshin. Alright, and we'll just attack with everything while we can. Dunamis Valkyria, at oh, reveal, scapegoat, ah. Now, I don't think Joey had this um, earlier, at earlier points in the story, but yeah. Once you get to the Battle City, Joey's deck does receive a bit of an upgrade, so he does have scapegoat now. So yeah. One of Joey's most signature cards, of course. Very nice, Joey. I'm proud of you. <laughs> he scapegoat to protect my life points, blood. Looks like you won't be attacking me directly. Uh-oh. Wait, 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 wait. No, that's fine. You're going to take my Valkyria. Um, yeah. Go ahead, bro. Go ahead. Because I'm going to still get the effect of Metal Morph, and you're going to take the damage. Oh, oh Now, he did make us destroy our own Valkyria there. But that could have been a lot worse. He could have played Magic Arm Shield when Valkyria attacked, and then we would have taken the damage, so... I'm honestly okay with that. I'm honestly okay. I end my turn, and now we have a light in the graveyard, so... As long as we can get a dark and draw a Black Luster Soldier, we're good. Yeah, go Gilfrey, the Iron Knight! Go attack his face down! You fool. Your Gear Freed has ran into my Knight's Assailant. 
Now, Knights of Salins, use your special ability. Go, sneak, sneak, legendary, slash. Very good, very good. Knight of Salem looks cool, man. So cool. Alright, I draw pot of greed. Now I activate pot of greed, Joey. This lets me draw two cards from my deck. And next, hmm, I summon Force Raider, the man beast, in attack mode. Go, Force Raider! Attack that scapegoat now! <laughs> Say goodbye to your pathetic monster wheeler! Force Raider, cut it in half! Alright. Now, watch in! Attack his other scapegoat! Looks like you've only got one monster left, wheeler. Da 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 Ah, one face down, Angel. Not bad, not bad. Hopefully it's not another scapegoat. That would be kind of annoying, but it might be, it might be. Uh, let's attack. Go, Force Raider! Destroy his last scapegoat now! Alright. No Mirror Force, that's good. And I think Joey does have Mirror Force at this point, so watch out. You know, with your attacks. Legit, direct attack. Good, no more skin gear. Good, good, good. Alright, main phase two. I think I'll set Magician up eight. That way we can get back pot of green. Alright, nothing in his hand. There we go. And there we go. I am my turn, Wheeler. Let's see what you got. Yeah, I summon Time Wizard once again. Go, Time Wizard. Time Roulette, go. Is he gonna get it? Ah, oh, darn. He got it this time, guys. He got it this time. Yeah, that one's gonna hurt quite a bit. We lost, man, we lost some really good monsters there. And all we've got is Morphing Jar, so. Not good, not good. Uh, no, nah, no, nah, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna play Shrink or anything. Yeah, not good, not good. <laughs> Time Wizard attack him directly. Alright. I draw Wheeler. Perfect. Go to Namas Valkyria in attack mode. Now I'll destroy your Time Wizard, Joey. Go. Shining. Valkyrie Light. Alright, this has been a pretty good duel versus Joey. It's been a little back and forth, you know. Got unlucky with the first one. Kind of stalled us out with scapegoat. You know, it's been good. It's been good. And I don't know what that last face down is, but apparently it's a bluff because he hasn't done nothing with it. So another monster, huh? All right. Well, at least he didn't draw something strong like his goblin attack force. Um, let's just attack. See what happens. Joey's monsters don't have the best defense, from what I remember. So we should be okay here. Uh, uh, uh well. I stand corrected. Yeah, awesome and little wing god in attack in defense mode. <laughs> Looks like my monster will be sticking around. Yeah, nothing I could have really done about that, I don't think. Let's see. Let's see his graveyard. And nope, nothing I could have done about that. So main phase two. I guess I'll set everything and I'll set morphing jar. Well actually. Yeah, yeah, let's set everything. Let's set everything. I was thinking about leaving a zone free, but I think we'll be okay here. I think we'll be okay. Now, Legendary Little Wing Guard can switch back to defense during his end phase. Graceful Charity, that's a good card. Ooh, he discarded Jinzo. That's kind of surprising. Uh, but anyway, Morphing Jar will go off here. But yeah, during each of his end phases, he can switch the battle position of Little Wing Guard. So we need to get something stronger than that. Hopefully we won't give him anything too good. Glad to see you get rid of Fairy Box, Joe. What'd we give you? What'd we give you? Another face down, another face down. Okay. Now I switch Little Wingar to defense mode. <laughs> All right, Joey. Well, we do have Sinister Serpent. Now I activate one of your cards, Joey. Go Grave Robber. Let's see how it feels when I steal a card from your graveyard. I'll take Graceful Charity, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and activate it. Go Graceful Charity. This will let me draw three and discard two. 
So let's discard uh, Sinister Serpent as well as White Magical Hat. Yeah. Alright. So now, what else do we have face down here? Collapse. Uh, right, Crush Car. Um, let's see here. Jinzo, but I don't want to shut off my own crush card. Let's just set a Spirit Reaper here, and let's attack whatever he's got face down. Let's see. And Versago. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Alright. You didn't have two little wing guard, Joey. Destroy that Versago now. Which is good. We definitely don't want Joey fusing. Uh, let's see, what time are we at? About 21 minutes? Well, let's keep going a little more. He's only got 20, 50 points. So if we can close it out, we'll be good. Rhoda, okay. Ooh, Goblin Attack Force, okay. Summon it, 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 summon it. He didn't summon it, what? What? All right, Joey. <laughs> Now you've done it, Wheeler. Let me show you the true power of a dual master. <laughs> I activate Crush Card Virus, Wheeler. Now say goodbye to all of the powerful monsters in your field, your hand, and your dick. <laughs> Kill for the lightning, goodbye. Your dick's about to be destroyed, Wheeler. <laughs> all right, and with that, I think we will be able to finish this up, guys. So, check this out. Our turn. Sinister Shepherd, return to my hand now. This deal is over, Wheeler. Now, check this out. I summon one of your monsters. How's it feel? I sacrifice Dunamis Valkyrie to summon Jinzo. <laughs> and that's not all, Wheeler. Say goodbye to that annoying little Wingar. Smashing round. Go. And now. To wrap this tool up, let's play it. The legendary Heavy Storm. All of your back row cards are useless, Wheeler. Say goodbye. Graceful dice. Why didn't he chain scapegoat there? That's weird. You should have done that, Joey. Go, Jinzo. Attack his life points now. <laughs> Say goodbye to his life points, Wheeler. I win. <laughs> You'll never be able to defeat me. Alright. And that was pretty awesome. We got to use some of Joey's best cards against him, like uh, Grave Robber, Jinzo. Pretty good. Pretty good. Alright, we win. And his own graceful charity. Yeah, man, I lost. This ain't my day, man. Alright, guys. Well, with that, we are at uh, 23 minutes. So I'm going to end the episode here gonna go back home and save but yeah that's gonna be it for this episode and in the next episode we'll be able to take on some of the uh evening and night duelists after we take the train so thank you all for joining me and i will see you all next time bye bye